Welcome back, Kevin's Mower Repair, 2012 Land Rover Range Rover 5.0 with the uh, beautiful Jaguar motor. So we are doing some spark plugs and coils and PCV caps. Not really called tubes because they're not or valves; they're more like diaphragm looking things. But <clears throat> so this way we're doing the driver's side over here. I've already done, sorry, I've already done the driver's side, I'm doing the passenger side, roughly the same concept. Um, take the air filter housing out for the passenger side. Did need to remove this bracket right here, this little protector cover for the battery in order to be able to gain access to the spark plugs and such. So here they are right here on new coils. This harness right here, unclip four clips right here and pull the harness out out and down and you can see the t27 torx bit bolts for the plugs themselves or for the coils uh, and then coils right here i have a long pick that you're able to get in there right in here and just up underneath take the tab off and disconnect the connector that way you don't have a opportunity of breaking any of the plastic clips that are on there as well. Oh, also disconnect the battery so I can get that uh, bracket piece out of the way. Um, how to use a rather interesting setup in order to get to the plugs. And this is the same for both sides because there's uh, not much room on either one. This is a 9/16 on a ratchet with a swivel. And a long extension so I can get out here. Front two aren't that problem, the back two are the ones that are pain in the ass. Also, I had to use an interesting setup for getting to the back two or driver's side case, the back three Torx bolts in order to get the coils out. This is what I had to use in order to do it. Uh, you can kind of finagle your way around underneath this AC housing and stuff like that with that extension it'll just get right in there use one hand to guide it and line it up and then the other one to uh, use a ratchet or ratchet and tool to take it out uh, I did take off this purge valve move it up out of the way in order to give more room this air housing also comes out which is real easy just disconnect unscrew this and this whole assembly just pops right out there's nothing no bolts or anything like that that are holding it in same thing for passenger side. Um, for the PCV caps, which are these, these are quite common for the diaphragm to fail and split. This is an aftermarket one, and it was thrown a code for a intake leak. So I put factor ones on there. Um, see all these little clips around the edge they're all the way around it so i just used a pick snapped off a couple and then it just comes right off new one goes on the same there's a little spring under there line it up click clip one or two and then tap around around the edge with a hammer and it will snap all the rest of them in place just not real hard because everything's all plastic uh one word of advice be careful about this coolant line this one has already been replaced, so this one's not that big of a deal for me. Being that it's been replaced, it's not brittle. But because you're working over in this area, you need to move this up and out of the way in order to get the plugs and coils out of the area. So just be careful of this if you are doing it for the first time or this has not been done before. Uh, this will likely snap on you and uh, you know, get you a nice coolant leak. But uh, if you can get it up out of the way, move it out of the way without it having a problem like that then you won't have to worry but just be just be cautious of it because everything on jaguars they're all plastic and they're very brittle when they get over 100 plus thousand miles which is what this one is so we are going back together i'm going to fire this up here in a couple minutes clear any codes that were in there and see what it does it uh someone had changed the coils in this and it looks like they used cheap aftermarket ones so I have more uh, higher quality ones and also did the plugs, which I don't think they did. But um, so once I get done, check and see what my theory is. And uh, if I am correct, 
customer will be on the way. If not, be diagnosed a little bit further. But uh, any questions or comments, please feel free to let me know.